Hey, what's up? So today I'm going to be showing you not necessarily a fix, but a way to get around a problem a lot of people have been having with Origin, this little guy right here, uh, which goes a little something like this. When you click on the Origin icon in the desktop, or the start menu, or down here in the taskbar, it doesn't open, as you can see. It may seem like it's opening right here, but it's not, trust me. Um, this uh, is annoying, <laughs> and it's pretty frustrating, um, but there's two ways, again, to get around it. It doesn't fix it, so you can open it in the desktop, but there are two easy ways to, again, easily get around it. So what you got to do is that you got to go back to the taskbar, but you got to go all the way over here, okay? And you got to find the origin icon. It's either going to be right here, typically, or you got to go to show hidden icons, and it should be in here. And you want to double click on origin. Because with the problem I'm having is that, um, much like a lot of clients, when you just click the close, uh, when you close the window, it's still kind of running. You know, it's kind of idling in the background. Uh, so it'll still, like, do updates and stuff like that. But it's not running as it would when it's actually open, okay? Um, but for some reason, when you click close, it doesn't want to open again. Um, but when you click exit, it actually will. It will launch again. Um, but there's also another uh, way to get around it is that when you go to the start menu, and you don't click on the origin icon, but you go over here to tasks, um, there's a bunch of different tasks you can do. Just select one of them just any of them. I'm going to go to the store and as you can see it's origin and it's open and it's working so uh, yeah I hope this helped you out and hopefully EA will fix this problem it's you know again it is EA but this was apparently caused from a recent update that happened like not too long ago uh, so hopefully EA is going to get on that and we're going to see a fix for it soon so you can actually enjoy opening origin in your lovely desktop. So I hope this helped you out and thanks for watching.